transformational regional change. That's the hope pinned to Ohio's share of the American Rescue Plan Act funding. This is really our once in a generation opportunity to revitalize these places that have intense, incredible histories um, and bring them back to where they were. This $500 million won't fix Appalachia's problems, but it will be a great drop in the bucket towards that. The funding will go to grants focused on three pillars, downtown revitalization, workforce, and healthcare. And communities will be given those funds by 2024, with the expectation the projects are completed by 2026. For Washington County, the money means renovating historic buildings. Maintaining historical relevance, being accessible to the general public, keeping it a comfortable climate, those things are all very, very expensive. So any of that funding, I think, is it's incredibly important. And Hawking County is looking to improve their workforce in downtown area. So we've talked about everything from internship programs for workforce development, housing, bike paths for connectivity across the county, giving all of our residents an opportunity that sometimes we've missed out on. But county officials are concerned with a combination of obstacles. There's a lot of confusion about whether the rule is being vague is a good thing or a bad thing. I think for communities like ours, it's definitely a good thing. Um, for people who don't know where to start, it's, it's probably bad. bad. Officials fear smaller communities lack the experience to put together effective grant applications. And finding developers to complete these projects may be a struggle, especially with Intel coming to Ohio. But they want us to spend, you know, half a billion dollars during the same three to five years that Intel is being developed, at least around here, it's going to be a problem. So, economic development officials say they're focusing on collaboration. Everybody was coming up with essentially the same things that need to be addressed. So there's this cohesiveness instead of everybody trying to operate in silos separately from each other. Ohio Appalachian communities hoping to use a historic opportunity to create generational change. For Newswatch, I'm Claire Shiopita.